Coming back also to a point that was raised by, by Jeroen earlier, uh, because we all we have the time to, to, to make these changes and, and get used to it uh, when it comes to the recreational level of, of, of our game. But in our high performance uh, part of the game, um, and I'm going to ask Adam also about his opinion about that. Yeah, 2026 is, 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 is around the corner. Uh, and the, the interesting remark made by, by Jeroen is, yeah, will there be a level playing field, not just level playing field, but will there be a, a level playing field for all competitors at that World Cup to have the same possibilities of, of practicing and getting used to the new surface? Uh, Adam, what are your concerns about that? I think that's a, a huge concern because, of course, with Paris being played on a water-based uh, pitch, then we will um, all teams competing there and trying to qualify will be training on a, an irrigated pitch uh, in the lead up to that event. So we'll start, you know, trialing um, non-irrigated pitches um, late 2024, start of 2025. Um, that's assuming you can get access to one um, and and some nations will have access and others obviously won't. Um, and this is not something that, you know, you, you'll get right first pitch that goes down. And then, as you say, it's, it is around the corner. You have then a World Cup being played on, I would say, still an experimental surface and and you know, I think we would need some sort of guarantees that if these surfaces are, are are not ready, and by that I mean, you know, that they there is a significant difference in the, the quality of play. I agree with you, Ron. I don't have too big a concern about ball speed, but I have a concern about how the players interact with the surface over a long distance. As he mentioned, that was a, an excellent point, and I was going to raise it as well. You only really see it over a long distance. And um, you know, if we were having a rise in injuries, would we just simply push on and say, now we've made the decision? Or would we uh, have, a, have a discussion with the nations that are, are involved uh, in these tournaments, whether it be qualification tournaments for a World Cup? Um, so not only the competing nations, but um, you know, I'd want some guarantees that our, our athletes and teams are going to be consulted in terms of uh, do they feel that these surfaces are safe uh, for athletes at the major events? Mm -hmm. Mm 